I think Nizar Aboud of Al Mahdi in television in Lebanon. Mm -hmm. uh, there is no bigger humanitarian crisis and human rights council, uh, uh, crisis in the world bigger than Yemen. The starvation in Yemen is going on unabated. All calls by Security Council were ignored totally. The aid is not flowing as we were promised. And uh, in the recent days, we've seen regular systematic massacres in marketplaces, in petrol stations. However, we do not hear anything from the United Nations. Why is the silence and why we don't see any program to meet about Yemen, given the dire situation there? Thank you for raising this issue. Actually, we have this uh, issue in our footnotes. Uh, why in footnotes? You can ask why not in a uh, kind of program uh, of work. Uh, we, uh, we think it's a very important issue, but uh, we have this cyclical uh, kind of uh, return to that issues. And uh, as for Yemen, it's, uh, we, we consider that in the Security Council uh, by monthly level. So, Next time we will look at that, it will be in February. Uh, uh, I mean, it will be in the program of work. Uh, but we have it in footnote because if situation is further deteriorated and one of the countries would like to raise it, we all the time have it kind of, we, we all the time ready to uh, start uh, talking about this in uh, the main program. But uh, since, uh, it is, you know, it was considered in December. Now, next time, it should be uh, on the agenda in February. So we kind of uh, missing this part, but we have it in footnotes. If something happens, we of course will uh, will. But how worse can it go? I mean, the sit the current situation is bad enough. Was there any other crisis in the world? I know this. That's why I'm saying that uh, in case any country will raise it, we are ready to to consider that. Will you raise it in the Security Council? Uh, not at this point of time, uh, because for uh, putting it into uh, uh, the agenda, I think we need the consensus of all the rest of the members. At this point of time, we all agree uh, agreed that let's put it into footnotes and see if uh, there are further developments on that issue. Then we will take it, pick it up as an uh, issue during our program of is there any indication that the Secretary General will raise it? Because among the UN staff, there's been a lot of reports that, in fact, there's, there's the basis of famine there, and that there's what the blockade is keeping the UN activities from functioning. So have you heard from the Secretary General at all? Uh, I haven't heard uh, from Secretary General about his intention uh, to put it into the program of work. We met, uh, but uh, again, I think, uh, the situation is uh, very fluid. Uh, I mean, it could uh, go offhand very quickly. Uh, we are very much concerned about it. We are ready to discuss it. Uh, but uh, as soon as Security Council finds that the Secretary General's role involvement uh, uh, could be crucial in that, uh, the recommendation will follow. Uh, at this point of time, uh, we don't have such a proposal on the table, so we're not discussing it this way. But uh, it doesn't mean that the question is not so critical or serious that we're not putting it to the program. We just, you know, every month we have a big load of issues to consider, and we try to kind of be rational, uh, trying to, uh, to focus on the issues which are recurring, trying to resolve them as well. Uh, so, uh, but any issue can arise and we can work on it.